Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody posted this on Facebook, and it's got some gray areas, and it's and it's got some white. It's actually the gray uh, area around this that's dirty, and it's actually engraving the finish off this. It looks like a bamboo phone cover. It is a, he sent it to, and he doesn't even have Corel. I'm just trying to help him clean it up. He sent it as an SVG, and you can't do anything with it. You can't convert it to a bitmap. You can't break it apart. So I exported it as a PDF, you know, uh, and I brought it back in so we can work with it. So I'm going to make a copy of this. I'm going to control D and make a duplicate. I moved it over. I'm going to take this one. I'm going to go to bitmap. I'm going to go ahead and resample. I'm going to make it 300, even though this doesn't matter in this case, because we're not probably going to use the picture. I'm going to convert it to a bitmap. I'm going to convert it to grayscale and then I'm going to go trace the bitmap and I'm going to outline trace and clip art and it's going to take just a few seconds to do this and because there's a lot of facets and with this particular file there's really only one thing we could do tell you what I'm going to extend my yellow box I'm going to send send this one over further and I'm going to Take my now my new trimmed graphic and I am going to break it apart. Go to object, group and ungroup. That way I can put a boundary around it. And this is gonna take a little bit of time because there's a lot of facets. And you could probably just go with this, but we want to kind of use the original graphic and I'm going to send you both. This might actually engrave better than this. Um, might be a little bit better to engrave. But then now we can move our boundary over. Now, I don't like using power clip too much. But in this case, you almost have to. I'm going to grab that. I'm going to go to uh, object, power clip, place inside frame. And now I'm going to take all this and I'm going to right click take away that outline so now you have the original graphic and like i said i'm going to send you both these files um, this might engrave better because it's got you know different colors and uh, facets in it but that's how you do it i'm actually going to get and make a second video on this and how he can center this up in this phone he even mentioned that it's off center I hope that helped him a little bit, and thank you for watching.